Okay, this is my review of the Trek 8.2 DS. Uh, I mean, if I had to sum this bike up in one word, I'd say awesome. You know, I had this uh, really cheap Diamondback. Now, Diamondbacks, I'm not down in their company, they're probably good, but I had a $250 bike and it broke down like four times in a month. So I went ahead and upgraded to this, and it's a tank, man. It's, it's amazing. Uh, I think it looks really cool. I like the gray and white. Um, you know, so let's go through it now. So, first off, this bike grew on me a lot too. The seat, first glance, looks super uncomfortable. And the first couple times I sat on it, yeah, I had some soreness, but I decided to stick with it. And, you know, today it's one of the most comfortable seats. It's easy to ride on, so you get a lot of room to pedal. And, you know, it's just enough cushioning. And I realize biking's not really about being super comfortable. You're not in like, you're not sitting on a couch here. You're riding a bike, so, you know, it's a good seat, solid seat. Um, I put my own pedals on it. It comes with plastic pedals, which is kind of a downer, you know, but. So just upgrade 30 bucks, put some pedals on there. Um, the wheels are 700 cc, really nice, nice traction on here. Get up close in there, so you can see it. You know, so you can really go over some, uh, get some grip on the road. Um, it's got a, it's got a suspension, you know, a fork here. It's good for smoothing out bumps in the road. It doesn't lock though, like the 8.3. You know, so that's, that's uh, a little annoying. I don't know, it, when, when I'm pedaling fast, it kind of feels like you're riding a horse because you're bouncing up and down. It's not so bad, I don't, I don't know. If I locked it, would it be that much better? I don't know. Um, yeah, so let's go over the gears. It's 21 speed, Shimano. So I think the camera's a little blurry here, but. Yeah, I mean, you get up any hill, so. It's a big chain in the front, it's got a guard there, three, and then in the back you got seven, you know, so I get up any hill I want, and I think this is a great bike, it's kind of like half mountain bike, half uh, road bike, I guess that's what a hybrid bike is, but uh, I think this one's really good. Uh, the brakes aren't great. For some reason, when I press the brakes, it takes a while for them to kind of come into action. Even on my cheap bike I had before, the brakes would stop very fast. I don't know what that's about. 8.3, I know it has disc brakes. But, you know, all around, this is a really cool bike. And the price is, what, 550 So, I mean, it's a perfect bike for New York City because it's, you know, just expensive enough to be very awesome bike and just cheap enough not to get stolen everywhere you put it. So yeah, that's my review of the 8.2 Trek DS. Um, great bike.